So, um, you can see here, what I've already done is set up the problem where I'm multiplying through by a common denominator. So that way I won't have any fractions because I don't want to have a denominator with a variable. Um, so if, since the denominator is x minus 8, I'm going to multiply both sides by x minus 8. And therefore, I have to do a little bit of distribution. But it should make my life a little easier because those divide, those divide. So now I have to distribute through. Um, and this is going to end up giving me... Uh, x squared plus 8x minus 128 equals 1. And so now I just have a quadratic to solve. I say, all right, how do I solve this? Well, I can subtract both one, one from both sides, so that way it's equal to 0, um, which is always a good starting place for almost any um, polynomial that's squared, cubic, quart quartic, whatever. So now we have that equation. We say, how do we solve it? Well, if you don't see the factors, if you don't see how to break this thing down uh, into you know x times x, and since it's a negative, one of them has to be positive, one of them has to be negative, um, and so it's going to be equal to zero. Um, if you don't see how to do that, then, which by the way I don't either, uh, then we're going to have to go quadratic formula, which would just be x equals negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac blah blah blah, all divided by 2a. Um, so in this problem, our a is 1, our b is 8, our c is negative 1, negative 129. You sub all of them in, and it'll give you your two answers. I hope that helped.